His timings are perfect. Ecclesiastes chapter 3, verse 11. He has made everything beautiful in its time. Now that's a scripture we quote very often, we hear very often, but it bears so much of truth for us that God beautifies everything. He brings everything to their perfection in their right timing. And so when we go through our time of endurance, when we persist through time, when we persevere through time, there is something we must keep in mind and remind ourselves, you know, God is going to make this whole thing beautiful in its time. That means he's going to bring this thing that I'm pursuing, that I'm going after, whether it's a goal that you want to see fulfilled, a dream that you want to see accomplished, uh, an assignment that you want to fulfill, uh, a certain level of grace and character, uh, whatever you want to see develop, that you're going after it. Yes, it's taking time. You're going through the process, but you remind yourself that one day it's going to be beautiful. It's going to come into, God is going to bring you into the fullness of this. You're going to see this dream realized. You're going to see it uh, accomplished right now. It it's, it's looks far away. You're looking at it from a distance, but a time will come and you will be in it. You will experience it. You will have it. You will possess it. And God will make it beautiful in its time. And the Bible tells us, you know, in Hebrews chapter 12, that we run with endurance. The race that is set before us, looking to Jesus, who for the joy that was set before him, he endured. That means he went through his time with endurance because he knew the joy was up ahead. In the same manner, you and I, we run with endurance the race that is set before us because we know there is a joy set before us. We will have that. We will experience it. God will make it beautiful in its time. So, run your race with endurance. Be persistent, persevere, be patient. You will inherit the promise that God has spoken to you. Let's pray. Lord, we ask for the grace that empowers us to persevere, to be persistent and not give up, not quit, until we inherit the promise by faith. Thank you in Jesus' name. Amen. Thank you for tuning in to Living Supernaturally. For more resources to strengthen your spiritual walk, please visit apcwo.org.